pain relief, there are many over-the-counter drugs. Some may even seem interchangeable. Not true. Depending on the type of pain or injury, taking the wrong medication could be ineffective or downright harmful at the worst. A recent Wall Street Journal review of the two most popular over-the-counter pain relievers, ibuprofen and acetaminophen, points out the differences between the two and which to use when. Let's break it down. Ibuprofen, or Advil and Motrin, belongs to a class of anti-inflammatory drugs known as NSAIDs. Use them for sports injuries like a sprain or arthritic pain. They may also be effective with headaches and help fight fever. But take too much and they can cause stomach and other other GI bleeding, so those on blood thinners should be cautious. Advil is generally considered to be stronger, it's a better pain reliever, it's better in reducing the fever. Even more so, it's really tough on your stomach. Advil can give you ulcers, heartburn, you really have to be careful to take it with food or milk, and um, some people are a lot more sensitive than others are. Enter acetaminophen, or Tylenol. It's effective for pain control, but less so than ibuprofen. And unlike ibuprofen, it's considered safe for babies and pregnant women. The biggest risk, excessive use. The maximum recommended dose by the FDA is three grams now, which was cut recently from four grams. So that comes out to uh, six 500 milligram pills. So if you take three grams four days in a row, you're fine. If you take even two, three, or four uh, doses on the same day, you're probably going to die from irreversible liver failure. So that's the knock on Tylenol, is that it, it has liver toxicity. Also beware when keeping track of dosing. Tylenol is found in many cough syrups for pain control. To read more on the story and others, you can head to our website, aksha.org. And while you're there, don't forget to also sign up for your daily dose of news delivered straight to your inbox.